All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Monday, and that means that we're using blue eyes. And uh, actually, we're on salvation. You're probably like, wait, why are you on salvation? Because uh, uh, Death Row has a serious error. Yeah, yeah, Synchro Summoning is pretty much broken, and they need to fix that, like, ASAP, because it sucks. <laughs> it sucks real bad that I can't even uh, play with any deck that Synchro Summons. Like, it's like, it's like you have a tuner and you have a non-tuner, and then, you know, they're like, oh yeah, that track going off, let's Synchro Summon. And you select the tuner, and then the non-tuner can't be selected, and then you just time out and lose. It's just like, wow, alright, well, that's, that's, that's fun. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, definitely not the biggest fan of that, so until they clean that up, uh, we're going to be on Salvation, and hopefully it gets cleaned up by the time we do tags, or we're going to have to figure something out, we might even just have to go straight onto YGL Pro, like, just straight up YGL, because, yeah, it's not going to work. It's definitely not going to work. Dude. Dude. <laughs> what was that? It was like, oh, I can activate my effect. Let me pop a back row. Let me top my own fucking scale. Like, that was dumb. That was d yeah, yeah, just go ahead and quit. J John Panda, mmm. <laughs> ah, be right back. So, yeah, Synchro Summoning just completely broke on Death Pro. Uh, you know, I went on the forums, I was checking to see if they were doing anything about it as of late, and yeah. So, anyway, it's a blue eyes time, people. So, uh, get ready. <laughs> Renny's not here. I think he's taking a nap, so hopefully I can do the plays with myself. We're going against the Speedroids. Alright, wow, he's just gonna go straight into his ninja guy. Like, alright, let's start starting with him. Just build up the special summon monster you can let the card gain double its original tag. Oh, I would say this looks like you're about to just say fuck it and uh, <laughs> sink past him. Like, alright, so look, look, see, Synchro Summon's actually working here on top. You wouldn't even be able to do none of this on Dead Pro right now. I'm not saying that De uh, De Salvation's better than Dead Pro, but yeah, but ho so hopefully this gets fixed by the time it's time to do the tag duel. I might have to just do on YGO Pro. I mean, I have all three of them, but it's just like, wow. Just like Death Pro is like my go-to one, and then sometimes Salvation, sometimes others, so... Yeah... Now the question is, is what is that set card? Oh yeah, and then the ninja goes ahead and gets his Takatan board back, which is just... Just fantastic, that's, that's totally what I want him to get back. <laughs> so, but now the question is, what, what's that set card? What, what is that set card? What are those? <laughs> uh, so, at least I know I can Synchro Summon. I guess I could go into him and him, but I, I don't get why the Synchro Monsters have the reverse blue eye stats. It's like, why? Like, what do you b get benefit from that? So we're gonna go ahead and play our Ancient Rules. And in the Ancient Rules, it says that I can summon blue eyes from my hand without trivet summoning because, uh, screw the rules, I have, uh, green hair. And I'll just go ahead and click, kill, kill your, uh, kill, kill your, uh, your, your, your wing. And I'll go ahead and normal summon, get my search on. I already have a Maiden, so let me go ahead and get an Ancient Stone. And we'll just go ahead and sync it up, go ahead and go into, uh, I guess the powerful blue Eyes Spirit Dragon, because blue Eyes Spirit Dragon can then summon me Azure Eyes, and I can use that whenever I feel. Oh so, yeah, these two. So besides that, uh, blue Eyes of course got some, is just continuing to get some new cards, new cards, new cards, this card's great, this card's great. I was like, I was like, yeah, this is exactly what this deck needed, like, something like better than white stone, <laughs> ancient white stone. It's just like, whoo! <laughs> all right, so he's gonna, he's gonna try to do some fucking butt surprise attack on me. Like, all right, <laughs> like, nah. I'll just go ahead and hop out the way. So you can just go ahead and miss, and I'll just summon my Azure Eyes, which is just ah, beautiful, beautiful. So speed, go ahead and get that back. So far, everything is going. Totally according to plan, except for this blue eyes in my hand, but hey, if I get ultimate, you know, I'll be fine. So, Taka, summon Taka. <laughs> Just all the Taka Town Borgs, like, alright. <laughs> so, who are you summoning? Red Eye again? Yep. Make this six, and then go into... Four. Okay. What's a win level five? Because you have to go into a win, so I'm kind of thinking, what's win level five? Oh, I'm, I don't see this guy very often. Alright, so... What do you do? During either player's turn, you can trip this card to increase the level all fast up monsters in the field and by one until the end of Ugh. This card is in your... While this card is in your graveyard, right, if you control a speed roid tuning monster, you can also special summon this card. You can special summon this card, also you can special summon monsters for the rest of the performance. Oh, so, you put him in the graveyard and he'll be useful later. Got it. Got it. I'm not really blown away by that, but uh, do your thing. Do your thing. So we'll go ahead and just summon blue eyes back. 
Hmm. I'm debating on what I want to do. I think I might just go ahead and uh, summon you. I'm running all the I'm running the ancients and stuff like that. I'm just trying to find the right rate, the ancient rules. I'm trying to find the right ratio between blue eyes in my hand, blue eyes in the deck. Blue, like that, that's probably the biggest uh, problem with this deck is just keeping track of all the blue eyes. Like there's just so much blue eyes. You know, it's just so much, so much blue eyes. So it's it's really difficult to keep track of every single one, every single one. So go ahead and uh, freak him up a little bit. Kill him. I'm on effect. I can't be destroyed or what is it? Like, giant type monsters can't be destroyed or targeted. It's just like, wow, the power. And what's in your hand? I believe it's Taka. No, I think it's a red-eyed dice. I think you returned red-eyed dice to your hand, right? Cause there's only one in the graveyard. Yeah, there's only one in the graveyard, unless you banished it. No, no, no. So I think that's the only card in your hand. So someone knows that card, Red Eye Dyson, and whatever you're drawing into next turn. And then this effect lasts until the end of the next turn, so I'm still safe. Still safe. Alright. So it's like a Call of the Hunter or something? Oh, you're just gonna summon him back. Yep. And then what? Go into him? Like, really? Yeah, yeah, he's just gonna go into Kendama. Like, alright. <laughs> That's what you wanna do. I have no complaints there, Kandama is actually not bad. <laughs> Alright, so we'll go ahead and send Blue Eyes back again. The power, the white power. <laughs> white power, white power, what? Oh, I would say what? <laughs> mm. I'm okay right now, like I'm really okay. I said I, I just need to find a ratio with how much revival, how much summon Blue Eyes in the deck, how much summon Blue Eyes from the everything. So I'm gonna go a little bit aggressive because even if he kills this, I don't care, I still have this and I still have this. Oh, okay. So, when your opponent's monster declares an attack, you can target one spirit of monster in your graveyard. Banish both it and one spirit of tuner monster. Okay, if you do, spell someone one. Uh, it's from your deck, one synchro monster whose level is the original level of those two monsters. During the opponent's battle step, you can banish this card from your graveyard and then target one. Face up, attack this synchro monster. Oh my god, this is like a mouthful. Like, who, who typed this card? Wow, and I can't even. I can't scroll down. <laughs> oh, and just, I guess, just make it attack directly. Whatever. Yeah, I guess I'll attack you. So it really doesn't matter. I don't really care what happens to my blue eyes. My blue eyes is expendable to say the least. Oh, you're just gonna click it on me. On this. Okay. Like I said, I'm still chill. Nothing nothing bad has gone wrong for me in this entire duel. I've just been totally good. I mean, he's playing a lot of speedway cards that I don't either don't use or have not seen, because this is not. <laughs> eh? Really? <laughs> Look how slow this man is taking it. Yay, revival. So, like I said, it seems like I may have to run more cards that deal with uh, blue eyes in my hand, because I can clearly see I'm getting some clogging shit. I'm running the triple ancient rules, but I took out the trains because I felt like I really didn't need them since I'll be summoning a lot from my graveyard, but nah. Now they're in my hand and I can't do shit with them, so, you know. Well, I could probably be drawing more of my revival cards, like more of my silver cry and shit, so. Yeah. So, is it like I can't attack? Well equipped by, well equipped by this card, that monster cannot attack, also its effects are negated. Alright, so. Can't attack him when the fixer negated, so I'll just switch him around. Like, you're getting it. Like, you're getting it. You're getting the blue eyes beat down. Like, you don't understand, man. I got white power. This is white privilege right here. Wow, nice top deck. <laughs> nice top deck, I must say. <laughs> that's fine. You can have that. Danny, what a matter. I'm still chill. Like, that. that's the sad thing. I'm still fucking chill. I'm ice cold. I'm blue ice cold. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with these puns, aren't I? <laughs> Uh, is there anything I want to do with you? I can go ahead and summon and get another tuna monster and shit like that, but... Meh. Meh, Sage Knight. Meh. <laughs> you can discard this card and target effect monster control. Send to Grey, right? If you do, special summon one blue eyes monster for my deck, then you can... Blah, 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 blah. Okay. This card... Leaves by its own effect. And leaves the field to control of that monster that was equipped. Oh. Alright, so, I'm gonna pitch you, get rid of you, because you're kind of useless at this point. And then I'm gonna go into my spirit. And 
and then this can go ahead and hop out the way to make me. Oh, okay, my plan's gonna quit. Okay, this can make me hop out of the way to summon a blue eyes from my hand. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, uh, of course I'm gonna get another duel in. This duel, this video is not nearly long enough, so I'll be right back. All right, another duel. So let's go ahead and use that white privilege to go ahead and win this duel kind of style. Wow, I just put the trade ins in, and then <laughs> I was like, let me put some trade ins in. I only put in two because I was like, ah, I have ancient rolls, so it's better than trade in. And then I draw them, like, of course. Of course. Oh, and we're, of course, going against fucking PP Pendulum decks, like, or, you know, you know, magicians. Like, am I the only one that's kind of getting sick and tired of this Pendulum mechanic? I really am. I'm getting kind of bored of it. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I, I really am. I'm getting bored. <laughs> it's all I see is just Pendulum, 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 PP. Not just that, it's like, I get it, I get it. The pendulum mechanic is really busted. I understand. But I'm just bored of it now. <laughs> I really am. I'm bored. Why would you activate this? Like, let me ask you a question. Why would you activate this? Like, there's no reason for you to activate this. You're not planning on pendulum summoning this turn, you know? I would've just kept it in my hand. Because if I destroy it, then that's just gonna be one less pendulum monster you have. Like, that's that, that was not smart. I mean, it seems like his plays are a little better than the freaking first guy who <laughs> destroyed his own shit, but... Yeah, cause that would've been dumb, he'd be like, a oh, fuck, pitch, pop. Yep, yep, here we go, here's that insight magician. Well, <laughs> oh, blue eyes. Cool. So I, I could, I could, I could go in. The question is, do I want to go in? That is, that is, good. that is a big question. That is a big question. I could probably trade in. I said, I can enter and rule summon blue eyes, but what does that do for me? That's the question, what does that do for me? I have a 3,000 beater, and I'm probably gonna get jumped the hell out of by my opponent. And he might have odd ice fusion too, because I'm planning on summoning Maiden. Yeah, I think I want to go ahead and get a little bit deeper into my deck right now. So I'll push the blue eyes. And get another blue eyes. Alright. Hello? My phone is going off? Hold on, I gotta get that. Alright. Fuck it, get deeper in the deck. I got a sound notice, that's how it's Oh, and then I can just ride my blue eyes right back out of the graveyard. Everyone loves their dragon type monster and I'm supposed to summon it. Okay, target a level 7 or 8 dragon type monster in your graveyard, special summon it. Your dragon type... Um, I have level 7 or 8, level 8 dragon type monster, so how come I can't activate prayer? Am I reading this wrong? Like, prayer is actually really great. The dragon monster, like, I can't activate prayer. Like, that's annoying. To activate something that says I can't summon for the rest of the turn? Like, no. That's weird. Like, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Talk about level 7 or a dragon type monster. It doesn't say it specify normal monster or anything. I just can't summon it. Like, that's annoying. I, I can't summon my blue eyes. If you control a dragon type, if a dragon type monster you control, it'll be destroyed by battle by card effect. You banish this card from your graveyard and it's dead. Yeah. So, what's wrong? Is it, is it only level 7? I don't think so. What the, what the what the what the fuck is wrong? What is wrong? A revival? Like, did, it's because they changed their name from freaking gospel gospel to prayer that my freaking card is not working? Or am I just playing it wrong? Because I clearly see a level eight dragon type monster right here. I would love to revive this blue eyes. Does it only work for Felgram? <laughs> that would be that would be bad. <laughs> also, before you pendulum summon, you might want to destroy my set card. Like, I only have one. I don't think you have a magician. Wow, you're just gonna ram into me. Alright. Yeah, I'll let him use our pack. Yes. No, no, no. Someone blessed him to death. No, I'm okay. Uh, this is gonna work. Purr is gonna work. For some reason it's not, but it's gonna work. It's gonna work. Cause I don't see anything wrong with it. It's not a very complicated card. You just target a level state 7 or 8 dragon type monster in your graveyard. Special summon it. What's wrong? Why can't I activate it? Just says so I can only set it. Like, you, you know, like, are you not working on salvation? I clearly, this is this is level eight dragon. There, there, there is definitely a dragon. Wow, you're gonna go balls in and tend to summon all this shit during your main phase too. Please summon more. Please summon more. Like, why didn't you use this to stop me? Like, well, whatever. <laughs> like that was dumb. That was that was. Mm. <laughs> Alright, you wanna work now? No, you're still not working. Oh, I have no idea why you aren't working. That's actually kind of irritating. <laughs> it really is. It's like, why why you no work? Why you no work? 
Go ahead and play Ancient Rules. Okay, so this says, if you have another hundred, you can add one face up, blah blah blah, from the extra deck, but you don't have any. This will just banish you, and you know what? I want you gone, because you're a pendant scale. Right, go away. Bye bye. Some reason, Prayer Revival won't activate. Yeah, good job. Yeah, you can't wave ring eyes because you can't destroy your own shit, so get banished. <laughs> oh, that was funny. <coughs> Uh, you just gotta quit. Like, wow. Like, this deck is. I, I mean, I know I gotta play it on freaking tomorrow, but I wouldn't be fucking up like these two people. Well, they're making me look good with the deck, and I barely play it. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and get another duel in. Be right back. Alright. So, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with that card. I really don't. I, I, I searched it up on YouTube, and I was like trying to figure it out, and I was like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, I was like searched it up on YouTube. I searched it up on the wiki. I was like, maybe, maybe it can't summon blue eyes. Maybe no, no, it can summon blue eyes. So I don't know. <laughs> so I just took it out, putting Call of the Hunt. It's, I mean, it's a little bit slower, but <sighs> fuck it. <laughs> no, I, I was playing it because it was a revival spell card. Like blue eyes loves them revival spell cards, man. And you just, you just leaving me hanging. You just leaving me hanging. And I don't like you right now, not even in the slightest. So if my opponent's gonna go ahead and take it slow, I'm gonna go ahead and take it a little bit slow as well. Uh, I opened up with my Keeper. Uh, I was wrong. I was mistaken about Keeper. He's actually pretty good. So, we're gonna definitely gonna run him. So, uh, 21 booty, 2 tributes from blue, uh, a monster, yep. So, yeah, buddy. I'm just gonna go ahead and tribute and summon my, uh, White Spirit. Then fuck it. I'll just keep on looping the White Spirit with the Keeper, and the Keeper will get his, uh, his good on. Oh, no, no. Nothing his good has come of, oh. <laughs> I was like, nothing good has come of freaking uh, my opponent. Summoning summon monk, but then they just leave it alone. I'm like, okay. So, white spirit, go ahead and destroy me some back row. <laughs> like, you don't need it. You definitely don't need it. You don't need it. Wow, it was bottomless. That sucks. So, nothing of mine goes off. That That's actually irritating that it was bottomless. <sighs> I was like, fuck. Like, why, why bottomless? Everything but bottomless would have been fine. But no, it, it was bottomless. Like, I wanted to get my shit in the graveyard. If you would have killed me, this would have been uh, nah, nah, bottomless. All right, all right. I still got plays. It's just that really hindered me, like really bad. Uh, you know what? Mm. I didn't open up fantastically, so all right, I'm gonna go ahead and summon you. I'm gonna normal summon you now. Now you are gonna go ahead and banish me. That. Thank you. Oh, rippling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, rippling. You're so strong and manly. Storming! Fuck! <laughs> this duel is so fucking annoying! <laughs> Why? I wish I would've got rid of the storming. I could've handled the rippling. Like, I wanna kill this fucking monk before he goes off. Oh, now he's gonna go off. Fuck my life. Like, wow. Wow. I was like, I could throw a regeki at him, but... Like, oh, God. So annoying. <laughs> Oh my god, all the fucking back row. Like, will you please stop? <laughs> That's fine. I have a Regeki. Seriously. Like, no, nah, summon Mirror Force, put it back in your hand. And you, you just had to fucking struggle the audacity to try to fucking summon it from your fucking, uh, from your hand all that fucking time. Like, nah. Like, okay. Oh, now I get you. You would have been fucking fantastic a couple turns ago. Like, get, just get Regeki. Tired of this fucking shit. I'll just take the duel slow. And if he doesn't want to take it slow, then I'll take it fast soon. Like, so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> so when she attack, when she hits you, she just inflicts 100. Because why not? Like, eh, 100. <laughs> like an extra 100. Because why not? Oops. <laughs> Ah, uh, I hit a button. <laughs> Holy fuck, like I'm saying, these, these, all these, these rippling and storming and so many forces, it's just, the force is strong with this one. I can't, I can't, you know what, I shouldn't be allowed to say that because I have never watched a Star Wars movie in my fucking life, so. <laughs> I really shouldn't be able to say that. I said, he's using the, the, the panther, the, the moonlight. 
deck that's really aggressive with this fusion plays, like completely and utterly aggressive. I've never been the biggest fan of this deck, so. Thank you. Now, I'm, now I get to fuck you up. Summon you back, and once again, normal summon. No, just, 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 just him. I don't need to tribute you too. And hit that for me. Yeah, get that out of here. All right, look at look at this. I got some fucking calls that are just stuck on the field right now. So I could go ahead and go into one of my uh, what's it called? You know what? I think I, I I want to because I believe some of his moonlight things float. So it'd be good to go into uh, spirit to handle this. Ba 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 da da da. Next button. Yes, I think I think some of his shit floats. So. Oh, no, it's just another stoner monk. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it says, once you turn during your first turn, when effect is activated in the graveyard, you can get the activation. Pretty good. Not bad. Not bad. So I got him, an alternate. Not really doing much. I got my Silver Cry, though. That's good. I got my calls, I got my Silver Cry. Like I said, the revival. Hopefully, maybe Gospel will get fixed. Like, I don't understand. It, w it was a different name, too. Like, that's the thing that like, caught me off guard, is that it was a different name. Uh, usually it's gospel of revival, but on here it was prayer of revival. I was like, okay. So I was like, I was like, I typed in gospel. Oh, yeah, I typed in gospel and it wasn't there. So I was like, okay. Let me go ahead and type in. Oh, let's say you got a poly. You're gonna go ahead and fuse it up. Cool. So maybe some of these can contact fuse or something. Like, no, no. Like I said, the deck just revolves way too much around poly. Like, I would love if a monster when it uses a few material, you get poly back in your hand, kind of like uh, how fluffles have, or some of them can contact fuse. Like, it's just like, hey. You don't got poly, you ain't doing shit. Like, that's my problem with that deck. I think it's interesting, it's just, you got a poly on poly on poly on poly on poly on poly. It's just like, mmm, mmm. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna get one more duel, one more duel. And hopefully things will go better and I won't get back with the hell like that duel. That was that was kind of annoying. All right, we are back. All right, another duel, last duel. So like I said, I don't know if that was an error or not. If you guys can tell me what I did wrong with the car, please, because I definitely feel like I fucked up. I feel like I'm like, what the fuck is going on here? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, hers is errors on Dev Pro. Now there's errors on Salvation. It's like I can't do shit, can I? <laughs> I can't do shit. So we're going up against the DDD. We'll be seeing that on Wednesday. The deck is slowly going up in popularity. I must say, it's actually. Uh, some relevancy and this guy's name is blue peeps ydd. I thought maybe he'd be playing some blue eyes stuff That would make him blue eyes off. Oh, he's actually playing hell armageddon. I don't play hell armageddon. I don't, I don't see the point <laughs> I really don't uh Struggle's gonna be real like this, this deck sometimes has a problem getting over fucking Big beaters like that like how the fuck am I supposed to get over here? And of course my synchro monsters are like itty bitty teeny weeny fucking only uh <laughs> only uh, 3,000 booty, not 3,000 attack. Like that's annoying. It really is annoying. <sighs> I can go ahead and ancient rules, and I, c I can't get over him right now. Like I, I, I literally cannot get over him right now. I, I kind of want to go ahead and wreck him though. So, let's go ahead and ancient rule, summon this, banish that, because I don't want you to have that. That's a given, but. I was having the same problem when my friend uh, Fonzo was dueling with the deck DDDs. I like a 28 is just so fucking strong. It's just hard to get over. It really is. So I guess I'll just sit on my freaking 3,000 booty until I can figure out what I want to do. I'll set this. I'll set this, and then I'll just be like, "Go ahead." I got my keeper, and keeper's great in the graveyard. It's just I need to get in the graveyard first, or I can get some plays and I get some blue eyes in my hand, like. The first turn is this. There's a 28 beater. Okay, 28 is nothing to scoff at. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Wow, he's just gonna just go like, nah, I'm my turn. Alright. I so said I could always switch out for what's it face, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and take it slow. Like, there's really no point in me going off too much right now. I got blue eyes, so that's great. I can go ahead and tack over him. Like, I got plays, it's just. I need to hold out. I need to hold out. I wonder how clogged his hand is, or does he just absolutely have nothing besides just Oracle King? Hey, he still has slime. You gonna kill my keeper? That's fine. Yeah, 
Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and switch out. Cause I need I have some I need a way to summon my blue eyes back. Oh yeah, I'm gonna switch out. Wow, that's annoying. Ah, uh, cause I'll notice you. I really could. Oh, that's fine. That's annoying though. It's really annoying. No, don't activate your effect. So I could just throw the Regeki at him. I was already summoned in defense mode too. No, I'll take it one more turn slower. I'll let you even out. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, I want to summon my Agrarian and all that. And he's like, nah, I'm XC. Fuck! <laughs> I just knew when to throw down that Maxi. Uh, Silver Fry. Summon you back. So you're not gonna go off. This card is normal summon or special summon. I say, like, no, this is the this is the effect of summon from my hand. The blue eyes. What the fuck? Why don't you go off? This card is normal summon or special summon. You can target one spell or trap card your opponent controls and banish it. Why the fuck did you not go off in Silver Cry? Like, all right, all right. Like, fucking piece of shit, I swear. Like, wow. That's really annoying. Like, I wanted to summon you so we can go ahead and banish this. Like, did you miss timing? I guess you missed timing off the fucking Dark Crown track. I don't know. Like, shit, driving me fucking crazy right now. Like, what the fuck is going on? I don't feel like dealing with him, because he's going to summon him, and then that's just more bullshit that I got to deal with. Like, no thank you. But yeah, that's annoying. That's annoying. I <laughs> definitely wanted to go ahead and just get rid of it. I guess you missed timing off of that. I really wanted you to go off and fucking banish this dark contract. Because I guess you had to be the last thing to resolve in the chain. <clears throat> Ooh, Kepler in the Pendulum Zone. Like, why? I guess he's playing on Pendulum Summon. Like, uh oh. Yep, yep, here we go. He's actually gonna Pendulum Summon. I don't see that a lot with this deck. I mean, I haven't been Pendulum Summon a lot. Maybe you can actually pull off the, the good, the good, good, but I, I've never done it. <laughs> yep. Did you summon you? Do you summon you? You, 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 you. Alright. So yeah, I'm still sitting okay right now. I'm still not gonna get blown away. Blown, blown back, get my nipples blown back. <laughs> so I'm still gonna, I'm still in some deep shit though, because I'm gonna say you're gonna fuse into him. That's what I thought. You're gonna go ahead and fuse into fucking the big old Oblivion guy. That's annoying. Okay, so once per turn, this card declares an attack involving. Oh, you can target one Diggity card. The Dark Contract can control return to the hand. If you do, equip the one favorite monster. Battles, this card gains, blah 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 blah. Like, nah. I'll just make you miss your attack, I'm good. I mean, there's really no point in you coming back trying. You're okay. Like I said, I still have Regeki. It's just I gotta deal with all of this. Like, all of this. Like we already know, DDDs are known for their freaking uh, <laughs> for their plays that it go to the extreme, definitely. So go ahead and activate Azure. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and send me White Spirit back. <sighs> now the question is, what do I want to banish? So like I said, I think you missed timing off of that. I want this Dark Contract gone now, I want him to search for anything else. He, doesn't, he won't have anything to pen- oh yeah, he will! He will have something to Pendulum Summon. Cause I'll be regecking and then he'll, he'll get all his shit back, that's annoying. One turn, if a monster be destroyed by effect, you target one of those monsters that gains juicy attack and- it, what, it can't be destroyed by card effect or something? Damn it, damn it, I wanna read this, like I'm having a hard time in this duel. This card cannot be destroyed by spell and challenge that do not target, ugh. <coughs> I got Dragon Shrine, I don't know what the fuck that's gonna do, but I got it. I 
I think he might have this duel because I, I literally have nothing. I'm already pattering out of resources and plays. And I guess I don't have any more blue eyes in my deck. Wait, why didn't you go off? Once returned during the end phase, this card is in the grab because it was sent there this turn, which it was. You can special one blue monster from your deck. You didn't go off during the end phase. What the fuck is going on with this deck? <laughs> like, am I just completely and utterly playing it wrong? Oh, of course, he draws into another one. Of course. I banish it, he just drops decks into another one. Like, alright. That's fair. Like, I lose. I, I clearly lose. I obviously lose, because that's just bullshit. Like, what the fuck is going on? I sent you. And it says, during the end phase, this card is sent to the grave route, which it was. It was sent by Dragon Shrine. Like, what the fuck is going on? What the fuck is going on? No, fuck it, I lose. I'm just wondering what the fuck is on. Once per turn, during the end phase, if this card is sent to the grave because it was sent there this turn, which it was, you can special summon one blue eyes monster from your deck. I didn't have all my blue eyes in the deck, so how come I didn't get to special summon the blue eyes? Like, um, Salvation, I'm not sure if your blue eyes shit is broken. I mean, Death is broken, but if your blue eyes shit is broken, you might want to fix this for next week. Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, is everything broken, or am I just playing everything wrong? Like, what the fuck is... Tell me, what the fuck did I do wrong with Ancient White Stone? And tell me, what the fuck... Because I was going to lose anyway, it doesn't matter. Like, fucking dude, he bounced back so easily, and he just had the perfect cards. Like, everything was just perfect. He had everything perfect. Even when I tried to interrupt his play, still perfect. Uh, but tell me, what's wrong with fucking Ancient White Stone? And tell me what the fuck is wrong with Gospel. If you can tell me that. On, if it's Salvation, then tell me. If it's because I'm playing it wrong, tell me. Because this is just stupid. <sighs> anyway, I'm done. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow with, uh, uh, Punjo Magicians tagging. You find out who I'm tagging with tomorrow. And, uh, hopefully that goes okay. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.